Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I'm going to show you how to install CROM 4.4.4 KitKat on your Google Nexus 5. If you want to watch my full review, you can see the links in the description. So, let's quickly do this. So, first of all, make sure you have a working um, recovery um, CWM or TWRP. And if you don't know how to install that recovery, you can also uh, check the link in the description. I will put the link in the description. Um, that's a full tutorial of how to install the latest version of the recoveries to your Nexus 5. So, so the download link for the ROM is in the description. First, you have to download the ROM, and then you have to download the 4.4.4G apps, and then put them in, uh, in your Nexus 5 root of the storage. Okay. First, okay. Let's. First, you have to do wipe that effect to reset. And as you can see, you have these options. You can do wipe all user data. Um, after doing that, go to install zip. Then we have the option choose zip from SD card. Then go to this zero storage. Then we have all our um, storage uh, files of full internal memory. And as you can see, I have CROM KitKat version 7.1. Now hit the power button over here, and we uh, hit this power button here, yes install, and after the installation, all you need to do is you need to go back and then install uh, the G apps, these are the G apps, Module Micro 4.4.4, and these G apps are pretty good to use, you can use any G apps, but be sure that they are compatible with 4.4.4, same as uh, hit the power button on the G apps, okay, and then click install here, hit the power button and make sure before doing that you make the backup of your previous ROM because I always always make backup uh, before you know um, you know doing this stuff because uh, basically you don't know uh, what will happen if you install a custom ROM even though you have done everything uh, you know correctly but of course always always makes uh, make a backup like I always do um, and also uh, that's a pretty good thing, you know, to make a backup on CWM, you have these options here, backup and restore. You can hit the power button right now to backup to SD card, and if you want to restore from SD card, you can hit the you know, power button, and you have the uh, your um, backup. And if you want to restore, click the power button again, click yes, restore, and your device will restore. So, how, uh, so this is how you restore, but of course, uh, to download the ROM, you can uh, visit the link in the description. So be sure to like this video and please click the subscribe button down below and I'll make more videos for you guys, more ROM reviews. If you want to see some specific ROM review, you can comment down below and I will install it on Nexus 5. So I'll see you next one. Peace.